Hey guys, Dr. Drew Hittner here with Midwest Chiropractic Neurology. Today I'm going to be showing you um, the laser maze. So I have this laser here on my head. Let's see if I turn that on there. And what I'm doing is centering the laser to the center of my face. So that way when I'm moving my head around, I know that that laser is reflecting where my head and my neck are. So this is really good for people who have chronic neck pain, who've ever had neck injury, head injury, any sorts of those things, or people who have the chronically tight shoulders and traps, anybody whose head is coming forward like this, that sits at a desk during the day, this is gonna help us retrain your neck movement, relaxing those muscles, allowing you to maintain better posture um, throughout the day so we can get over this chronic pain cycle that you're in. So I'm gonna show you guys how I do this. So the closer I stand to the maze, the more I actually have to move my head, which is better, it makes it a little bit easier at first as time goes along, then we start to move a little further away and work more on the fine movements of the neck. So I stand first right here in the middle of the, the maze, and then I adjust the laser so that way it's in the center of the maze. Then starting at the one side, I'm gonna trace through the maze, trying to stay right in the center of those lines, using my head and neck to move the laser through. And you can see, keeping it in the center of the lines, very important. And this gives me a lot of visual feedback as to where my head and neck are in space. Without the laser, I would have no idea if I was actually staying within the lines. So I'm going to complete the maze, going in one direction first. Once I've completed the maze, going in this direction. Reaching the end over here. I would then go back through the maze in the opposite direction. This is very, very important, very, very helpful for people who, again, who have that chronic neck pain, who have that tension in their neck, who have that loss of range of motion, maybe it's flexion, extension, if they've been in a car accident or something of that nature. So this is very, very effective using the eyes and the movement of the head and neck together to get that problem resolved. So I hope you guys enjoyed this one and take care.